exercise 6b, the first question is asking us to do a sec graph. Well, sec is 1 divided by cos. So let's draw a cos graph first of all. And that takes us up to 360 degrees there, doesn't it? So then if we go down another one, that'll be 450. And then we need to go all the way down to 540 degrees, which would be here. We need to go the other way as well. And so all the way down and all the way up again, that's minus 360. And then we need to finish that bit down the bottom there. This point here is 1, this point here is minus 1. So there's the original cos graph. And what we're doing now is we're doing 1 divided by that. Well, 1 divided by 1 is 1. And then it's going lower and lower and lower. So 1 divided it will go higher and higher and higher. At this point here, we're dividing by 0. So we're going to have an asymptote here. In fact, there's going to be an asymptote here as well. So whenever the cos graph is 0, there's an asymptote on the sec graph. Why they wanted to do quite so much range, I don't know. So this bit here, 1 divided by something really small is something really big. And so the graph continues like this here. And now we're just going to get it repeating up the top there and then down the bottom there. Same on this side here, there, upside down here the right way up there and that part there as well. So there is the sec x graph. We're going to do the same on the cosec in the next video.